As we teased at the top of the show, the recently crowned Miss Texas USA will be joining us for her very first TV interview since receiving the crown. And as you can imagine, our crew was more than happy to make her feel right at home this morning and offer her some advice. Take a look. Hey, Allie. Yes, hi. I'm Laura. I'm one of the producers. Nice to meet you. Hey, so I heard this is your first TV appearance. You might be a little nervous. Let me just give you a little advice. Don't look directly at the camera. Okay? okay. It's kind of a no-no. It's called spiking. We really just, we don't like it. Okay? Okay. So you'll be fine. Good luck. Thank you. Hey, Allie. How hi. are you? I'm Shannon. Nice to meet you. Well, welcome. Thank you so much for coming. My pleasure. Don't be yeah. nervous. Now, just a little thing that I've learned from many years of reporting is look directly into the camera. I mean, okay. burn a hole into that lens, okay? God, you'll be fine. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Hey. Hi. I'm Larry, the floor director. Nice to meet you, Larry. I want to give you a little tip. The mics are very sensitive. Okay. So just talk your normal voice, just like you talk to your boyfriend or something. Okay. And you do great, okay? All right. Got it. Thank you. Hey, Ali, Shane with, sales and, with the sales and marketing team. Listen, I've been doing this for a long time, and trust me when I tell you, you're going to want to speak louder than normal. Don't just use your indoor voice, okay? You want the mics to pick you up nice and clear, okay? Okay. Nice and loud, Ali. Got it. Got Ali, it. hi, I'm Carrie. Hi. Nice to see you. Look, nice see you. I know you've kind of been getting it from everyone. So sorry about that. <laughs> you're going to do fine. Just ignore it all. You'll do great. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you know what, though? One thing, if you don't mind. Keep your hands in your lap. It just makes you seem more relaxed, kind of in more in control. Okay. Do that. You'll be Got great. It. Okay. Thank good luck. you. Hey, Allie. I'm Carla. Hi. I'm just going to fix your mic on just a little bit. So this is your first live interview as Miss Texas USA. It is. Yes. Let me give you a little bit of advice. Okay. Use your hands a lot. Be very expressive. Shows excitement. Okay. okay. Come on. Got let's it. go on. Okay, we weren't obnoxious at all. <laughs> Please say good morning to Miss Texas USA, Allie Nugent, and congratulations! Thank you, thank you. Well deserved, and we're so glad you're making GMT your first spot after being crowned to give your first TV interview. Well, thank you for having me here. I feel honored. Oh, I do. Of, course, <laughs> of course. Well, you were just crowned, what, last week? A week ago from yesterday. In Houston. So yes. what was that like? Did it kind of catch you off guard? Absolutely, yes, because uh, this time I had planned on going in just to make top 15. So coming in and winning was a blessing actually. <laughs> We're watching the video right now so what was going through your mind as they're going fourth runner-up, third runner-up and you're still there and yeah. it gets down to the wire. What were you thinking? I was in a completely different world at that <laughs> point. I'm just repeating oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I wasn't expecting it at all. I was I was so happy. I was speechless. I had no words. Yeah, look at you. You look speechless. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Beautiful though and there's the crown and you say here's the crown this morning. Mm -hmm. There's a story behind this? Well actually yes. I I watched a TV show um, a couple years ago about some lottery winners and one woman wrote down $11,900,000 on a piece of paper and she slept on that piece of paper every night. And so when I got to the hotel with my mom, mm -hmm. uh, I wrote on a, on a piece of uh, a little sticky note, Miss Texas oh, USA 2013. Is this the actual note? Yes, and oh, I slept on it that. all weekend. Oh, wow. And so it came true. Yes. I'm going to hold it up because okay, I don't think we can see yeah. it. Can we get a shot of it, guys? So this is the actual note, and you slept, it's the actual you, you note. put it under your pillow. I did, and I slept on it every night. I took it from my mom's room the first night to my room all weekend with my roommate, wow. and I slept on it. Well, yeah. I know it wasn't just a piece of paper, though. There's a lot of preparation <laughs> that goes into this. What, do you, what kind of things do you do? Well, I practice walking. Mm -hmm. I practice interview. I have to diet, eat right. Of course. Of course, yeah. And, you, um, are you, know, you still doing the bathing suit and all that stuff? You, do they still do that? We do, I'm yes. I'm so out of touch with the pet. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, obviously diet and exercise very important. Yes, What absolutely. else? Just, uh, you know, like the interview is a big part of it. Sure. So I really try to focus on that and practice on that. You know, being quick on your feet, knowing all that you've written down on your answer, on your judge's form and everything mm -hmm. is is something that's very important. And I imagine too, up to speed on your current events and got to know events, what's going on in the world. Yes, politically, global issues, everything you can imagine that can be asked is well, asked. As I'm sure you know there's a great track record coming out of the Miss Texas USA pageant. I want to make sure I get this right. So as of right now, nine Miss Texas USA winners have gone on to win Miss USA. 
-hmm. So did I read collect correctly that you are the first to actually come from Dallas? Uh, in, in a while, I believe it's it's been, the Crown has not been back in Dallas in a while. I've heard it's been 20 years. A little over 20 years, So yeah. what's that like? It's something I didn't know winning. I didn't know that I had brought the Crown back to Dallas uh -huh. after so long. But it's an honor. I feel blessed. I'm so proud to represent Texas over yeah. the next year and go to Miss USA. I just hope I can make everyone proud next year. I'm so excited. Okay, so now that you've been crowned, what entails while, while you reign? What kind of things will you be doing? I'll do a lot of appearances. I love working with charities. That's mm -hmm. something I love doing, giving back. I'm, I'm very into that. Do so you have a specific platform? I, I do. I have a few. I, uh, my mom's a breast cancer survivor, mm. so I work with breast cancer. I want to do a lot with Susan G. Komen over the next year. Good for you. Um, my parents' business works with a one-to-one -one program in which we send food directly to... We're working with three orphanages right now, one in Ghana, Haiti, and South Africa, mm. ultimately to defeat global malnutrition. And also I, in high school, all four years, I worked with Best Buddy. So that's something that's very near and dear to my heart. Yeah. That's great. And I love your necklace, too. Can we get a Thank shot you. of it? Where did this come from? Well, actually, I think, funny story, I think I got a little bit bigger one than I think you're supposed to get. <laughs> bigger than that? <laughs> I, got, I got a bigger one than the normal, the normal size ones, I believe. I think the measurement story behind that was... A little bit well, confusing. you're representing Texas. Everything's bigger in Texas, right? I know. Why, why not? The bigger, the better. <laughs> All right. So tell us about the upcoming Miss USA pageant. It's coming up in the spring. Mm -hmm. So what will you be doing to prepare for that? Well, we're not sure when it is exactly yet or where, uh -huh. but um, most of the time it's in the spring and it's been in Vegas the last couple of years. So mm -hmm. we're thinking it's going to be there. Um, just working with a nutritionist, a personal trainer, a walking coach. Any an new notes coach. to write down that you're going to put under your pillow? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> i got to make that make one right one. now. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, let's see. Can you put the crown on? I can. I can stick it on for just a second. Yeah, may it's not. gorgeous. I might have to. Oh, yeah. It. <laughs> Looking good. Yeah. Congratulations again. Thank you. Are you excited you. to meet Mr. Trump, too? I cannot wait <laughs> to meet Mr. Trump. Is that like the highlight for you? <laughs> it is. It's something that's up there for me, definitely. Oh, that's yeah. great. Well, congratulations Thank and thanks you. again for coming on Good Morning Texas. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank and you. Sorry for, for being me. so obnoxious early. No, on I behalf enjoyed of it. all of us. Every second. I enjoyed every second. <laughs> all right. We're going to toss things outside now to Miss Shannon. Good morning.